Well, hello. Welcome back to the channel, baby. Um, it's another cover lover. And I'm running through some, um, through uh, suggestions that, that have been around a little bit. Um, and when I get up to date so you can continue to send more and it won't take me as long to get to them. Um, this is um, Running Up That Hill. It was suggested by Sully Wolfgang's daughter, spelled D-O-T-D-I-R. So, solid with Frank Gang, whatever, Sully is why I respond to you about. She, they requested this, um, K. Bush running up that hill in 1985, or they wanted the original, but also they said that Ivor had done a cover of it. And so I thought it'd be interesting since we do a lot of Ivor on here. Um, and, um, uh, last night, um, I went in the house and my bride was watching, um, uh, Stranger Things, and they're playing this Kate Bush song, and that's about the era that 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 show uh, Stranger Things. If you haven't seen it, I urge, you, I urge you to. It's the era that it was set in, uh, although it's a it's a new series over the last couple of years. But uh, it was interesting. I heard it, and I was like, somebody else asked for that song. So I looked up today. So that's the first thing we're gonna do. Um, as soon as I can turn everything on and off. Thank you. I'm not as always prepared as I should be, but you know the deal, right? Okay, headphones and get the screen up and here we go. So a Wolf Games daughter. Sweet. Here we go. So I'm only supping this up, but I don't it very much, but um, I don't remember the song. I, I feel like I should. Uh, there's a lot going on for me in 85. This is a long time ago, so uh, <clears throat> But I really like the sound, and I, I liked, especially the keyboard player, the, the guitar that he's playing. is It's not like anything I ever really, um, uh, <laughs> You know, what looking for. It's not what I used. I, I saw them in 85. I was playing keyboards, but the ones I used later were, were what they call MIDI activated. They didn't make any sound. That actually makes sound in a ghost or a processor. And it has sound inside of it and not on the outside, if that makes any sense. But I, I'm enjoying this. I like her voice um, for, for 85. Here we go.
I'm a guy. All right, let me get this out of here. And um, we'll, we'll talk a little bit about this. Um, so what do you think, guys? Um, I liked it a lot. I, again, I, I don't know the song, really. Maybe I do. I don't remember that I know the song. Um, it, uh, it has sort of the anthem kind of feel to it. And if, if I read this right, it's from 1985, so it's an older song. Um, but I like there's a lot of uh, kind of simply kind of elements to it um, that made it would have made it interesting to me at the time. Um, but again, I don't remember if I, if I liked it or not. Uh, but I did like that. Um, just some technical things. You know, obviously they weren't playing anything uh, because uh, there wasn't anything plugged in that I could tell. Um, and so, so they were seeing, they're singing to a tracker. There was a live band somewhere back there that they were playing to. Um, and was that her band playing with her on stage? And then the coordinated little steps they did forward kind of thing was really cool. <clears throat> and also, I, I had that suit, I think, in 1985, that one guy playing guitar. Um, exactly. But uh, it made, made me laugh because I remember this those shapes and colors and all that from so long ago and i hope you guys like that i did i enjoyed it and now we're going to do um ifer covering that song it says uh i've run up that hill kate bush song cover and again i have not heard this i do like ifer we've done i've done some of hers i want to say quite a bit of hers on the show so um let's give it a shot as we think I'm interested to see her voice and how she she covers this because usually her voice has got like a uh, a timber of like a little gnomes dancing through the woods. You know what I mean? i uh, like uh, like hobbits and elves, but uh, sorry, I was taking you longer than I wanted to. There we go. All right, here we go. Það er komið að atriði, það er áskorun frá mér. Það er hann artisti sem er dettur oft í eftir Kate Bush. Og ég er í þeirri fórindastöð, syngja fyrir mig Running Up That Hills. Sjáum þið.
guys get this off here and we'll discuss um well um so some a non-musical thing right up front um, is that um you could take that entire stage pretty much and drop them into a season or a, 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 a episode of the vikings and Oh, I was thinking that the whole time I was watching that, I was like, I mean, the guys, especially with the hair and the beards, uh, which I have a lot of big beard too, and, and her, uh, was the way she was dressed and the way she was moving and stuff. If you've not seen the, the television series called Vikings, watch it. You'll understand what I'm talking about. Um, it was, I enjoyed it quite a bit. Um, um, similar in a way to uh, Kate Bush. Um, she didn't sing it as witchy as a burger in the past, but she did a very good job. <clears throat> um, um, and I like the fact that it was truly live. And he started out at the beginning talking in whatever uh, Viking language to the people. And I forgot, I didn't cut that out. I mean, I didn't edit it beforehand. And I knew it was coming. I just missed it. Um, but regardless of that, um, all the instruments, you could hear them clearly. You could tell when the guitar player was mirroring some of the synth parts and also playing that kind of stroke pattern. And he was playing, the bass player was playing simple, um, like, it's like 16th notes or maybe 8th notes. I, I really don't pay attention, but you know what I mean. And then the, the, the main black camp run guy was playing a moog. A lot of the, the newer music is going towards the older sound, not the older instruments per se you'll see occasionally like i'll have a an old moog or an old sequential circuits or something but i had all that stuff in the a's and it wouldn't stay in tune and it, the oscillators would get hot and it was and they, they sound good to me for the time <coughs> but i'll miss that sound if i, if I did I, you know was back there easily uh but you are seeing like you saw that move it's totally electronic i don't think there's a there may be a tube in it but i doubt it um, or maybe an oscillator, I don't know, regardless of all that. Musically, I thought they did a very good job. And again, I'm going to go back and research this song because I feel like I should know it. And, uh, and somehow I miss it. Um, so guys, if you like this video, and either one of them, I for Kate Bush, the man, uh, Sully, uh, Sully with Kane's daughter, um, give, give them a thumbs up. Um, if you liked uh, what you think, give it a thumbs up. Share with your friends. Right. Comment down below if you have another suggestion. Please send it to me. I'll put it in line and uh, put it on the list, which is getting longer and longer. And I'll get to it. It may take me a while, but I will get to it. Um, so that means you have to stick around. Uh, like, subscribe. Subscribe.
If you haven't subscribed to the channel, uh, please do. I love the guys to come in and they'd be a part of the family and uh, comment. I said that. I think I've said it all. But if I haven't, you can go watch the other videos where I have said it all. And anyway, until next time, peace. I hope you have a good day and I hope to see you again.